Hello guys, this is JD Gravity RC. Welcome back to my channel. What I'm going to do in this video is to troubleshoot, troubleshoot the um, co uh, to connection. How how you connect your X seven controller to your PC using Smart Pro Pro Plus to connect to FPV Free Rider. There are a couple of subscribers who inform me that they have some problems in setting up X7 controller to connect with FPV Freerider using the Smart Pro Pro Plus. So first of all, what we need to do is we need to uh, connect the X7 controller to the um, um, PC using the audio cable. So it doesn't matter which model you need that you use on the X7 controller so let's um, I have switched on the F7 X7 controller so let's let's start by turning on the smart proper plus so with the smart proper plus if you look at the screen now you can see that there are solid green and red lights. If you move your sticks up and down, the red lines and the green lines should respond. So they're basically showing, showing you that Smart Proper Plus is working and the transmitter is um, recognized. But um, if you're having problem, um, we need to to see whether the um, the sound with the input is too high. If it's too high, then you need to uh, turn it down a bit. So you need you go into the sound control panel, click on that and then you go to recording and you see the microphone so you need to click on that and click to levels if you look at the level now this is 80 and micro microphone boost is plus 20 so what you can do you can slide this up and down so there will be a point where if you slide too high up then it will start blinking randomly if it's blinking randomly, then that means your transmitter is not recognized fully and it doesn't work. So what you need to do, you need to slide it down until all the uh, lines are solid, like now. Maybe if you want to, you can even turn it, slide it down a bit further, just in case. So by sliding it down further, you can see that maybe it's more responsive so let's slide this down as well a bit further down maybe that's what you can do with this if you have a problem with the uh, transmitter connecting to a uh, smart proper plus so just slide up and down and troubleshoot also that way so once you've done that what you what we need to do is we need to turn on the FPV free rider and then we calibrate the controller with the FPV Freerider. So for a normal transmitter, you need to have the throttle zero at the bottom. So make sure that you select that. If you select this other one, throttle zero at center, that's for PS3 and Xbox controller. So let's do the bottom one and just click calibrate controller. So what you need to do, you need to uh, center both states and then click OK and then uh, move your stick to the left click OK so that, rec that recognizes the yaw to the up that's recognized shorter and put it back to the center so now the aileron to the left says raw and up that's pitch so everything is now calibrated if you can see the sticks are not in the 
correct place because say for example this the right stick it should be right in the middle so what you need to do you need to use the trim button slide it until you get it to the middle and then the other trim button you slide up and then you get it to the center so what you need to do now is just move the stick up and down right and left to see whether they go all the way as you can see it, it definitely goes all the way so that means the sticks are calibrated uh, properly now so the right stick is now fine now let's go to the left stick you can see that I have the uh, throttle stick right down but then the throttle stick is right in the middle to the right side so what you need to do in order to correspond with your throttle stick you need to use the trim button and to slide it down and to the left and now the throttle stick is exactly corresponding to your physical stick which is at the bottom but when you slide up it only goes up to the middle so that means it's not working properly so what you need to do now you need to do the scale slider so by putting the scale slider up you can see that the uh, sticks is moving up and down correctly now and I'm going to test right and left right, right and left is fine so if I put the stick in the middle Um, let me see yeah I think it should be alright now it may be slightly off Have it should be fine so once this is all done what you need to do is just click OK and let's test this out so let's turn the camera to third person and see whether it works or not however it seems to be about um, around 60% but it works so now this is self leveling so it's definitely responding to the input quite well let me see although it's on the low rates it seems to be like on high rates but that should be fine as long as you recognize that and you can compensate for that so I'm, what I'm going to do I'm going to do for acro mode low rates turn off the camera and go to first person view seems to be working fine So guys, um, I think it's working fine now and this is how you trouble, troubleshoot your uh, connection of your X7 using Smart Proper Plus to the FPV Free Rider. So try it out and let me know whether you still have any problems. 
So until next time, please like and subscribe to my channel. This is JT Gravity RC. Cheers.